Hello, welcome back. Before we move on, what I actually want you to do is I want you to do a little project. It's, it's very simple. It's just working with what we have already learned. Um, I feel like what we have learned already could be considered a lot of information, especially if you're brand new to JavaScript. And so what we're going to do is we're going to turn uh, a little bit of text, a few variables into an actual URL that you could possibly use in a project moving forward. So the idea is to take one, two, three, however, however many variables you need, manipulate them using uh, using replace, or uh, you could break it into an array and join it back together like we did in a previous lesson. Turn your URL into all lowercase because all URLs should always be lowercase. That's a good practice. Uh, and then you want to add your website name in front of it. Now, if you don't have a website name, you could use any name. You could use google.com, facebook facebook.com, uh, arcmont.com, whatever you really want. Your end result should really look like this. Now, there's two ways we can do this. Um, we could do it using a ton of the, the methods that we've already used, which I think is the best way to do it, uh, just for practice. There is a simpler way, which is basically, um, you could just write str or any sort of variable name is equal to, and then you put it in there. That's uh, not what I want you to do, though. Um, I also don't want you to write, you know, string one plus string two, uh, sort of, you know, this being string two and this one being string one, uh, you know, don't do that either. Get creative with this. Take the long way around. This is one of those times where programming the long way, just experimenting, breaking things, and, you know, just writing a lot of code is completely acceptable. You're learning. And while you're learning, a great way to learn is to write a lot of code. Uh, and then in the future, optimize it. And that's perfectly fine. So if you want to stick around for a few more seconds, I'm actually going to do this myself uh, in a way that I think would be useful using some of the different methods that we've already used, uh, including concatenation, to split, to join, lowercase, uppercase, finding, replacing words. Uh, I'm going to get a little bit creative with it. I'm going to take a long way around. I'm going to have some fun with it and uh, feel free to watch it. But if you really want to challenge yourself, uh, maybe pause the video here, uh, give it a shot on your own. And then uh, once you have figured out or if you get stuck, then, you know, resume the video and play through the rest of it.